Hey guys, I'm back with another review. Um, the other day, as soon as I did my little review on this lotion, um, I ended up seeing online that this was released. I didn't know this was going to be released, so then I went ahead and picked it up too, just so I can do a review on both of these. I did say I like this. I said that it smells exactly like the Baccarat Rouge 540 vibe, um, and it does. And to me, it totally does smell exactly like that same DNA as Baccarat Rouge. Um, maybe a tiny bit of berries in there and a little slightly floral, but um, overall it's just that same basic DNA. So now let's see what the perfume smells like. I mean body spray. So now let's see what the body spray smells like. I'm assuming it's going to be like the same thing. And this smells exactly like you would expect. Can you guys see it? <laughs> I'm just kidding. What do you guys think of this smell? Is it nice? I almost smell, and I don't know if it's because I saw this, <laughs> but it says Brazilian Jasmine and pink dragon fruit, and I do almost smell a slightly hint of Jasmine. But that could also be because this is here, and this is, um, I think these are lilacs. These are fresh lilacs that I stole from my mother-in-law's neighbor's house. I left the baby for a little bit there and I passed by these and I was like, I need these in my life. These are gorgeous, so it's cute. Look, it's a whole vibe. Anyways, back to the fragrance. Um, I do think this smells really good. It's that same DNA. I almost feel like they're a little bit late to the game, you know, like all the dupes and the clones already came out. Ariana Grande's Cloud has been out for a while. Um, so many clone houses have their own version of it but either way i think that their fragrances are a little bit more um, clean they use cleaner ingredients slightly cleaner and i think these can be sprayed in your hair it says perfume mist maybe this one's not one of ones for the hair this says that it has notes of the top is pink dragon fruit lychee essence and mid is Brazilian Jasmine, Ocean Air, and Hibiscus. And then the dry or the bottom notes is Sheer Vanilla and Sun Musk. I am getting though a little bit of like Jasmine floral in the spray. More than the lotion. The lotion is a little bit more like slightly berry. Like I get more of the lychee. And then this I get a little bit more of the Jasmine. I think it smells good. It's pretty good. It's not, obviously, I feel like with their bum bum cream, they just knocked it out of the park. Bum bum cream is like iconic at this point. So nothing's ever going to beat that, but this is pretty good. I do think their Cheriosa 40 is also really, really good. It's a great dupe for Vanilla Woods. So this is slightly more floral and it's that Jasmine scent. It gives me like 90% Baccarat Rouge DNA with like 10% YSL Libre. So that's just my thoughts. That's just my first thoughts and first impression on it. It might not be accurate and I might be highly influenced by the slide like that's sitting in front of me. But that's what I'm getting. I'm getting just a little vibe of YSL Libre because YSL Libre has that strong jasmine notes in there and I'm getting Baccarat Rouge mixed with a little bit. It's like if you were to spray yourself with a bunch of Baccarat Rouge and then do one spray of YSL Libre to, to layer them. I feel like that's what this would smell like. But this is like lighter, airier version of that. So this is really good. Uh, I think I'm gonna get a lot of use out of it during the summer. And it's pink, so I'm going to put it maybe in my May tray since I have a bunch of pink fragrances in there. So yeah. And I can layer it. I love layering anything that has like Baccarat Rouge DNA. It layers so well with so many things. So I'm definitely going to try that. Well guys, I wanted to keep this video short and sweet. So we'll leave it at that. I hope you guys have a lovely day. I'll see you guys soon. Take care. I just tore them off really quick and put them in this 
glass jar that my tia had given me with chiles de vinagre. <laughs> if you're Mexican, you know. 